please stop. Stop doing me, please. Shut him out. Shut him out. Shut him out, girl. I'm gonna cut your throat. Shut him out, girl. Shut him out. I'm gonna cut your throat. Okay. okay, please don't kill me, please. You're hurting me now. No. I'm gonna cut it short. Yo, you know me look so afraid when I see you walk the street looking so. I have on all them strings and things. You know me, no me not watch all the time, girl. Please, you know? I'm sorry, it won't happen again. I promise. No. I promise I'll make you stop. Stop your head to me. It's too late. It's too late. You're you by where you are. You're by your day. You can't blame me. You can't blame me. You still have more like you've got to deal with, man. You know me, no when you open the door to prostitution, you lead the way. You lead the way. Eh? Come on, girl. Take what you get. Check where you got, push him out, 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 why are you raping me, please, please, stop, don't hurt me, please, ah! yeah, move move on, move on, look, 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 wait, I want to hear you tell you, you can't scratch me, look, I'm going to bust your head, you can't, wait, just scratch me, move on, man, just look, move on, move on, girl, move on, okay, okay, now, right, okay, right, okay, Yes, right, the more I talk. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay then. Mm -hmm. Check where you get. Understanding. 
okay? Now let me tell you this. Jessica lives in a home with two serious adults, you and me, who knows the responsibility of raising a child. Don't stop me. Don't stop me. I'm gonna speak my mind now. No. These cases of rape have now begun to take a certain pattern. A pattern that has now become relative to that of the prostitutes. And you know what? It's even beginning to find its way into our churches. Please, please. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I am not saying that prostitutes should be raped. But sweetheart, they are the ones paving the road for our young ladies and single parents. Honey, they bring sickness and abuse into our communities from unwanted pregnancies and AIDS. Thomas, Gloria is not a prostitute. And I can speak you for making reference to her being a single parent, which is a mistake that's not merely her fault. What? What? A mistake that is not merely her fault, you said? Come on, Ruth. Are you forgetting that I know who Ben is? And as a matter of fact, he is not in another relationship. All because, what? She drove him out? Huh? Thomas, I thought for Jessica's sake you'd be more understanding. Ruth, wait, it doesn't appear to you that you have eyes? Huh? Must I use your eyes for you? Come on, man, Ruth, you open your eyes. These women want to live above their income. Yes, one man is not good enough. Thomas, I question the man that our daughters are coming to the front of their Was it you or your jury who sent them to the parents as prostitutes and that they should be raped, Thomas? Thomas, don't tell me this is your birthday. Okay, you know what? Let me have your attention, please. Have a seat. Because you know what? The theatrical drama is now unfolding. You give me your verdict, okay? Listen here. Single parents, no jobs. One, two, three, four, five children to feed Ruth. The first two, a different father. The third, a different father. Fourth and fifth, a different father. Now you have the back and forth court battle for child support. Honey, Ruth. A girl child grows up into that environment and see the flock of men coming around into her way will only lead to the only ambition set for her. At the age of 13 or even 14. Yes. Then her skirt becomes up at her waist. She wears no bra. And she is fully makeup. Now 13 becomes 20. Where? In the eyes of the beholder. Do you have a verdict, Ruth? Now I want you to pay attention to me, right? And you keep your daughter Jessica in mind when you go around the street and you tangle with those low-life prostitutes. Would you like something to drink? Or something to eat, Betsy? 